Mark, defeat on TV tonight. What's your thoughts on the game? Yeah, again, we've been undone through um, you know not dealing with set plays. Um, you know, something we got. We've been working hard on. We'll continue to work hard on. Um, but like I said, we seem like we're getting cruelly punished at the moment. But like I said, we've got to work, we've got to work harder on them moments. You know, we know it wasn't a corner, but you still got to deal with it better. Um, so we've got to continue to be brutal on ourselves. We can't feel sorry for ourselves. Uh, and we've got, like I said, got to keep practicing, keep believing in ourselves. Let's talk about the starting lineup. Three changes made. You know, Mo comes back in. You know, a few changes made. What was the thinking behind those changes? Yeah, look, we want to get a bit more physicality on the pitch to deal with those situations. Um, Unfortunately, you know, the first goal went in when Guinea Tories got injured and um, we've been really careful to do half an hour with him, 45 minutes with him. Unfortunately, as he steps off the grass onto the Astro, is um, on the different surface, his groin's popped, out, popped a little bit and, uh, you know, he's, he's unfortunately he's rolled off the pitch. So the game didn't get stopped and, um, you know, we're down to 10 men. But still, we've got to organise ourselves a bit quicker, get, be a bit more aggressive with our clearances and we weren't and again we, we've been punished um, you know, in the moment of time we're down to, to 10 um, like I said we've got to organise ourselves a little bit better and quicker and that comes with experience and professionalism um, like I said we've got to learn those lessons quickly It did seem to be a lot of players obviously struggling with injuries and you know it was a tough challenge things like that. do you think that was a bit of a concern for you this evening? Yeah look we've picked up more injuries and again to key people we're trying to shuffle the pack and get a little bit more experience on the pitch as quick as we can to deal with certain situations so we're getting undone by some basic uh, principles at the moment which we are working on but sometimes the experienced players deal with those situations um, slightly better because you only learn through, through your mistakes that's part of life and uh, at the moment we're getting, we're getting punished anytime we do something wrong so we try to shuffle it round and unfortunately it's just we're not getting that lucky with the injuries at the moment. I mean, look, Giles and, and Loco are two big, strong boys, two big leaders. You know, Gimme Torres come off today as well, who was a little bit of a stellar signing for us. And you could see it was only a matter of time till I felt that he was going to, you know, as you see his, his danger and his trickery and his power and his pace. Um, but look, the, the, the changes in the second half um, helped us. We, um, we had a good positive second half performance. We battled a lot more. First contact, second balls, which this league's about. Um, we done everything um, right. It was a good away performance that second half in the in, in, in the conference. You know, we got you got to compete. You got to battle first, and then the goal buoyed us, and we looked like we were on the ascendancy. And then, look, undone by set play, we shouldn't have been defending, but we were defending it, and we have to deal with it better. Someone has to get down the line of that ball, um, you know, and, and get a block in. But you know, that's the way it happens at the moment. You know, usually they fly over the bar. This one's flown in the top corner. You mentioned looking for experience, saying a bit more experience heads midfield. You know, Mo Silla's come on five minutes later, he scored his first goal and he also an equaliser. Yeah, definitely. Mo's come on and showed that we've got a little bit more of a combative side. Um, and that's what we, we've got to show at the moment. Like, we know we can play some good football, um, but we've got to make sure that we know our roles and responsibilities from, um, you know, during, during the game at key moments. And that's what's letting us down all the time. And um, we, we, don't, we don't want to be this pretty nice team. We need to be a tough, hard to beat team. Laurie Walker starts in goal for the game as well. What was the thinking there? Yeah, look, look, Laurie's, uh, you know, big, strong lad, wealth of experience. Um, I just felt that we needed probably a little bit of competition, a little bit of freshen up in there. And look, Mitch has, Mitch has done well for us, but you know, us as a club have let him down at the moment because you know we haven't had a goalkeeping coach. That's now he's now in situ now, so he, we can do some real hard work in that department now as well. Mitch has never really had that so the whole time he's been here, um, so we've we've tried to fix that and we would like to fix it a little bit earlier but that's now in place so we can you know we're just trying to improve all the time um, so we're learning some real harsh lessons and when you're down there things don't quite go that, that way but you know we can either feel sorry for ourselves or we can dust ourselves down and come back and um, and get better and that's what we'll continue to do how are their injuries looking or is it too early to say uh, it's quite early to say but both of them are groin issues um, I mean you can't run on a groin during a the game then there's some sort of strain or pull in there it's just what grade it is um, so look um, we'll take a, we'll take a check on them and look at them, but the early it, it doesn't look too good. The winner comes 86th minute. Rob Hall on the edge of the corner scores it. You know it's the 86th minute. It seems to be happening a lot recently. What do we do to make sure this doesn't keep happening? We've got to keep putting them in them scenarios and training like we are. We've got to keep working it. But people have got to take responsibility. Um, you know we, we know how we want to defend it. We know what we got to do. Uh, unfortunately, fatigue mentally or physically, wherever it is, it's just an excuse. People need to do better, and at the moment, um, those situations are letting us down. Bit of a break now for our next league game, but then as an opportunity to prove things right, hopefully, for the next home game. Yeah, I think we need training time at the moment. Um, like I said, we're 
much. We're a three-quarters team at the moment, and it's not enough in this league. So we've got to work hard on a lot of certain situations and scenarios, and it also gives us the time to dust a few down and try and get a few uh, few bodies back. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.